welcome back to my channel. I am Shelly and I am a full-time reseller on Poshmark, eBay, and Mercari and a few other like consignment kind of platforms. And today's video is going to be a haul from the Goodwill Outlet or the Goodwill Bins. And so this was 30 pounds I believe. So yeah, let's get started. Um, let's start out with a couple items that I need to... This one I'm going to fix, but the other one I might just like redonate. Um, but this is a really nice button front shirt. And this is Lululemon. So here is the logo. Okay, so I was kind of in a rush um, because I had to be somewhere right after. And so I kind of went through my um, like cart kind of quick. And I didn't notice that like half of these buttons... <laughs> are like gone so unfortunately there's no extra buttons in here so what I'm gonna do is probably um, just find some that are like similar see if I have any or just like buy a little pack of buttons there's like a gray little button so yeah so there's that um, next is this life is good tea and it has quite a bit of like discoloration on it it might be hard to see but um, it's on the front and the back, and so I like picking up Life is Good at the bins. It usually sells like anywhere from like 15 to 25 for me, so, but yeah, so this one will probably just be a redonate. Next up is this really nice Brooks Brothers dress, and I thought this was so pretty for the season. It's just like a light pink and like a darker pink seersucker, and it's just like a fit and flare, and I was actually surprised because this is actually a wool, like the dress is wool, which it's very soft, so I was surprised by that. But yeah, so it's really pretty. Oh, this is a size 4. There is that. Next up is this pair of J. Crew men's pants, and these are nice. They're really thick. They're actually lined with like a camo flannel, um, and these are a 32-30. So there are those and everything will be listed by the time this video goes up so if you want to check out how I price things or anything like that next is this pair of T and A oh, doesn't want to focus but T and A little joggers and this is a brand sold at Ritzia and these are an extra small I like the color of them they're really a nice like muted mossy kind of green Next is this dress, and this is the brand um, Standard James Purse, and it's a size 3. Why is this not focusing? There we go. Um, and this is a size 3, which is like, I think a large in their sizing, and it just is like a long sleeve, um, probably mini dress. Next is this cute little pineapple tote cooler and it um, has a strap on it and it's actually um, pink from Victoria's Secret and it retailed for $30 but yeah it's just a little cooler it has like a zipper top. I thought that was cute and super lightweight and just like a good thing for the spring and summer. Um, here's another Life is Good shirt. This is a Crusher tee and it's an extra 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 large and it has like a little dancing human and dog on there it's just a nice nice purple color so I did grab that one that one's in good condition um, let's see. next this is a big piece this is a nice wool blend coat and it has like this um, collar neckline and this is the brand Ann Taylor, and it's a size small. And I was excited to find this. I've actually sold um, a similar coat to this from Ann Taylor. I want to say it sold for 70, I'm pretty sure. Um, so not the best time right now for this, but I did want to pick it up because it was in good condition and it's like a really good style for as soon as we're coming into fall. So yeah, this is a top by the brand Bowden. And it's just like a pink little pink and white striped top and it has cute little like 
puff sleeves or puff cuffs, I guess. And this is size six. Next is another um, men's J. Crew piece. And this is like the classic fit. And it's just a button front shirt. And it's in a plaid colorway. Okay, um, let's see. Another J. Crew men's shirt. Um, this one is nice. It's like a really soft flannel. And these are both in a medium, if I didn't say. There's that. Next up, I like never pick up Nike. It's just, I don't really like know which pieces to pick up. But this was just in really good condition. I thought it was cute. It's very shiny. It just has Nike there. And like a funnel neck. And a little kangaroo pocket. So yeah, I wanted to try this. I think I only listed it at like 25, but we'll see. It's a medium. Next is this cute little vintage like woven backpack and this is the brand April Cornell and it has like a fun patterned like cotton lining in there and yeah so I thought this was good for the summer and I like the woven like leather on it I think it's really pretty. So we'll see how that does. Next, this was kind of an exciting find. Um, this is a Burberry swimsuit. So here's the bottoms, and I really like how it like has a little spell out of Burberry. It's like um, black and white polka dot, and it has a little ruching on the bottoms. So the bottoms are medium, and then here's the top. It's more like a string bikini style. And unfortunately, there is no, like, the tag was cut off on the top. So, I'm guessing it's probably a medium as well, though. So, there's that. Next, another fun vintage piece. It's just this really cute, like, wide, um, filled hat. Has, like, a little bit of wear on the inside, but I thought that was so cute. Next is the brand Ibex, which I really like picking up. This is a women's medium, and I don't know if this is like a tunic or a dress. It's pretty short to be a dress, and it does have like these zipper pockets, but unfortunately the last owner cut out the actual pocket part, and so it's no longer a pocket. It's just a zipper now, so there's that. Next up is a New With Tags um, American Eagle, and this is the newer tag, and this is from 2021, I believe, and it's just like a light weight kind of open knit sweater. It's the size large. Next is another New With Tag piece, and this is Eloquy, and this is uh, 18. And so this actually has a retail on there. It was $139.95 retail. And so this is just like a gorgeous light pink tweed blazer. And it does have, when I was taking pictures, I did see that this it has like a little tear in the lining, but it's in the lining, so you're not gonna see that one worn. So yeah, I love that. I recently picked up another Eloquy. Um, new tag blazer was a black one at the bins and that sold really quickly. I think it sold for like 50 so yeah. I was excited to find another one. Um, this is American Eagle and these are just like a nice dark gray wash and these are the mom jean style and these are in a size 6 regular. So yeah, these are in really great shape. I love picking up American Eagle at the bins. Um, a lot of their jeans I will pick up, like most of the newer tag ones, um, newer, newer label I will pick up. And then, what else do we have? Okay, we have a couple pairs of shoes. These are the brand Corky's, and let me see, there we go. And these are just like a wedge, a cork little wedge with like a leather. Um, top and these are a size 8. Oops. 
we lost someone. Okay. Next is the last pair of shoes. These are a pair of Vans, and this is actually my first time ever picking up Vans to sell. But these are just in really good shape, so I figured I would try them out because that's a good place to try it out at the bins. But like that logo doesn't have like any wear, um, and yeah, so they're in really good shape. The tread is really good still, and these are a women's eight and a half. So we'll see how these do. I think I think they're nice too because they're black on black with the black sole and the black canvas. So we'll see how those do. And then last, um, we for accessories is this beautiful leather bag and this is my first time ever finding this brand it is um, Proenza Schuler there is that and I was very excited to find this this bag retails for like almost almost a thousand dollars and it's in really good shape for the most part um, there is like a little bit of where it's kind of hard to see a little bit of like scratches right there um i did stuff it with like some paper but here is the interior as well and yeah so this does look authentic um i oh there's a little phone number in there um and there is still like this the tag in here that you're supposed to cut out but that's still in here and yeah, so I was excited to find this. I listed it at 500. This is like one of their like classic styles. Um, I believe it's called the PS11, um, like mini bag, and it has like their signature inverted um, metal hardware right there. So yeah, there's that. I was really excited to find that. That rolled out in a new um, shoe and like hard good bin. And nobody grabbed it and I like saw it because it was actually flipped open. I saw it so I saw the um, name on there. So that was exciting. Um, okay, I have a couple pieces that I'm going to take to um, a buy sell trade and then a couple pieces that I'm gonna send into thread up. So or yeah. Okay, and so I think I'm gonna do another video. I did one previously, but I'm gonna do another one where I film all the items I'm taking to a buy sell trade. And then I'm going to show you how much they give to me as well. So this first pair is just H&M. Um, but these are new tags. And they're just like a cute trouser. So I picked those up. I'm going to take those to a buy sell trade. And then another also new tag H&M piece. And this is a little like sweater vest. Which is still in I think we'll be in again in the fall as well so I grabbed those for a buy sell trade and then for a thread up I have a few pieces that I am going to send them because I have a box that I am packing up to take um this is the older tag of Talbot but they always take they don't always take it but as long as I send it in with like good condition and everything they'll take this brand from me and it always sells pretty quickly so it's just like a rose print kind of evening jacket next is another brand that sells pretty decent for me on thread up and it is bcbg um this one is the max Az max azura line and these are just like a faux suede little pant so i grabbed those Next, another brand I like sending in, this is J. Jill, and this is like a pretty velvet little button down, so there's that. Um, one more J. Jill piece. This is like a really nice dress, and it's in there like um, jersey, um, ponty kind of fabric, so there is that. And the last piece I'm sending in is this Talbot's wool blend little blazer jacket. So yeah, that is everything from this haul. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please subscribe um, for more content and like this video so I know that you enjoy this kind of content. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!